Okay, so I'm going to be expressing myself and standing up for myself because this is getting out of hand. To the men out there who believe that I should date you, as well as the other men who think I should get married to, please listen because I'm serious here. This is a serious conversation and I'm not backing down. I am someone who doesn't like to date online. And I also believe that I'm a person who doesn't want to get married. Now, to to me, dating is something that I want to deal in, do in real life. Like, actually go out and find someone who I can date. That's only when I'm ready. And right now, you know, dating-wise, I'm not ready to, you know, go out and find someone new. I got out of a nine-year relationship. Me and my ex-boyfriend, we started dating when we were 21. And we broke up just before we turned 31. So I want these men who want to date me online to understand that when I when I say that I got out of a nine-year relationship, that is true. I was in a relationship for nine years. Me and my ex, we didn't spend, you know, every waking moment together because he had a job. He also hung out with, he and I also hung out with our friends up until I decided to, you know, take a break, you know, hang out at home for a little while for myself and do my own thing, you know, and that includes job-wise, and, you know, do my own thing until I feel ready to, like, you know, go out and hang out with our friends again. And he understood that, and so last year, my ex, you know, promised to, you know, come over and spend more time with me because that's what I wanted, right? But... As, but in January of last year, up until June of last year as well, he kept making promise after promise after promise to come spend time alone with me. But instead, he chose to go hang out with a friend of ours more than he did with me. It had nothing, absolutely nothing to do with his job. He, In his own way, he believes that You know, I'm upset because he chose to, like, you know, other than, you know, hanging out with our friend, that I'm upset it was because of his job. No, that's not the real thing. Occasionally, yeah, I understand that it could be his job, but honestly, deep down, it wasn't. He just chose to spend more time hanging out alone with our friend more than he would like to spend time alone with me. So, and we chose to break up, go our separate ways, but still remain friends. And so, me and my ex, we talk every day. Like, you know, while he's at work. So, on my end, I understand. So, and I get it. You want me to date you and all, but I'm not ready right now. So I want you to respect that boundary. Now, there's also people wanting me to go get married because they believe that I'm lonely and they don't want me to be lonely anymore. Well, you guys, you have to understand from my point of view, I don't feel comfortable getting married. I really and truly don't. If I get married, I'm going to live with regret of who I'm marrying. And I don't want that. Like, say that I do go get married. What if something happened during the relationship with me and any man that I, I get married to? What if he abuses me? I don't do well with abuse. Because I was really and truly abused as a child. And I don't want to live with that. And you have to respect that. 
I was physically abused as a child. I was verbally abused as a child. I was emotionally abused as a child by my own parent. And I don't want a man like that doing that to me. So you have to respect the fact that I don't want to get married. So please respect my decisions on when I want to date and me not getting married. So to the men out there who want to date me online as well as want to be my future husband, the answer will always be no. You have to respect my decision and my decision is final. So, please respect my decision and the boundary I created. Otherwise, please know that you will be blocked. So, I hope that people understand that.